friend of mine did a little sketch and sent it to me and asked me if I could make a octopus arm welcome sign for him. He, uh, he collects a lot of octopus stuff, so we're going to work on that in this video. Had a lot of fun with this piece. Uh, you'll see as we go along and progress. If I like them better when they're sharp. Yeah, there. I cut my finger uh, while I was sharpening, and man, it just bled all over the place. I thought it'd be a little funny thing to show here. Uh, the saw saw bite me. I've been playing around with different speeds, different angles of things. Uh, this this project is uh, is is really cool because <clears throat> it's kind of more up my alley. There's a lot of shape to it, a lot of forming, and you know it's fun for me. I I enjoy these where where you need to you need to cut big smooth curves. And, it's, it's a it's a nice uh, nice break from the bears and the, the eagles and feathers and and you know the, the more typical carvings hope you guys enjoy I was gonna do some carving today, but as you can see, my carving site is completely bombarded by honeybees, and they're pretty harmless. They're uh, they're busy. This is first signs of spring here. It's been warm the past couple days, and uh, even though I really can't get in here and work, I uh, I don't really want to disturb them, and. You can see if you look around, there's no other bees anywhere else but here. So this is definitely uh, a place that they want to be and and be doing their thing. So there's something in the sawdust or something that they're they're really liking. During this brief break in the carving, uh, I'm just going to show close-ups of the bees and my brother hanging out with them. He came over for the day. I almost got him in the camera. He was flying, right? right up this is day camera. two of the bees being in my carving site. Okay. My brother had come over to help me fix my truck, and and uh, he was pretty fascinated by the bees They're too. So busy working, and they got such a job to do. He's trying to pick that whole pile up. That is cool. Next day, not a bee in sight. I think it was forewarning what was to come for the following couple days. Uh, it, it was warm but overcast, and then I uh, well, got to the shop early this morning, and uh, I was I was here about 4:35, and it just started. It was it was pouring rain and get colder, and then. Uh, and then all of a sudden it starts snowing, so now we have, we have the freezes back. So uh, 
Yeah, I think the bees were uh, loading up. They, they, they must know. Um, actually, they do know from as far as you know, as far as I've learned, and you know, paying attention to nature and hearing stories from other people. There's uh, there's bee boxes up on the hill, uh, a couple hundred yards away from us there, and uh, I think I think that's you know where they all came from, and because there there was just swarms of them. But here's a uh, here's some shots, uh, doing some onboard camera, and and I'm not very good with the camera, as you can see. You got mostly got my head in here, but. Uh, these are interesting shots because you can see how how I make a curve cut and I just kind of work it in there and take my time with it and we'll show some other clips here from uh, from different perspective uh, that's kind of kind of cool using the using the old helmet cam I have to
Now we step into the shop. This is more of a nighttime activity. Uh, I'm working on the suction cup, and you see I'm just, just carving them out uh, one at a time. And uh, usually, what I have used in the past was a, a hole saw with with a paddle bit in the middle to make the suction cups, and then then cut out around them. It it makes a really nice round piece. But uh, here, I think I'm doing a pretty good job with just the saw, and. Uh, you know, this this piece I can't say enough about it. It's a it's a really fun piece. So uh, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll keep carving here. This is our springs here. Three days ago we had sunny weather, 60 degrees, and bees flying around the carving site. Today, well, it just finished raining. It was coming down like cats and dogs out there, and well, now it's Well, that's where we are at this point. Uh, <clears throat> I'll be uh, showing this in other videos as I get it finished up. And thanks for watching, everybody. Uh, if you like what I do and like to see more, like and subscribe and uh, put on notifications. We'll see you next time.